Hey guys, 97 Retro Game Nerd, and I know it's been a while since I made really uh, my last pickup, because, you know, that huge $1,000 haul, I mean, that really sets you back, you know, spending $1,000 as a 17-year-old, that's crazy. So, I've been really busy with that the past couple weeks, and I've just, you know, I just had to put up a wanted ad on Craigslist again, because I really haven't done it in a long time, and it really paid off. I mean, like, I was not expecting this at all, so... I just get a random text. They said, hey, I got a Nintendo 64 with six, seven games. I'm like, awesome. Uh, list the games, you know, or take some pics or whatever. So I said, yeah, we got, like, the new Tetris, you know, like, blah, blah, blah. We got, you know, a bunch of games. And um, I think I'm going to have to show you it first and then tell the rest of the story because I would kind of be giving it away. So I ended up getting all this for 60 bucks. Um, you know, Nintendo 64, 6 games, 60 bucks, not that great of a deal, but one of the games is really, really special. So, got a Nintendo 64 with an expansion pack, no cover, you know, uh, decent condition. You know, we've got the AC adapter and the uh, AV cables. And then we got two controllers. The toggle sticks are pretty bad on them, and you know, that's what to expect. I mean, it, it came from a city, and you know it's, everything is like dirty in there, so you know, pretty rough shape. And then we got, you know, uh, she actually found a few more games, so she just tossed them for free. Uh, Rugrats, the movie, WrestleMania 2000, uh, Banjo Kazooie. Uh, I just want to show you the condition of stuff. I cleaned up one of the games, the game that was pretty special, and uh, I just left this alone just to give you an idea of how rough the game was and how good of, of condition I got it in. So, you know, um, it looked like that. Superman 64. <laughs> Terrible game. We got Vigilante 8 with a Blockbuster sticker on it. And it's also on the back. We have the new Tetris. So there's that. We got uh, Mario Tennis. So it's sticker on and stuff. And the last game. I was um, amazed to see this. I'll just show you now because this is pretty spectacular. There's like, I mean... There was a 0% chance I was going to think that when they were listing all these games, it was going to actually be this game. So I'm just going to show you the game right now. The game is Clay Fighter Sculptor's Cut. Let's get a nice view of that. And look at the condition of the game. I mean, I mean, you see I mean, you know, a few flaws on the label, you know. But nothing really is a uh, a big problem, you know. I uh, swapped the back and uh, made it super clean. Uh, I cleaned up the top. They had like riding on the top and it was like dirt all over. So I just swapped the back, you know, no problem. I had a Blockbuster sticker on the back and like, uh, you know, one of those um, code, you know, like code back things. It's like that metal thing that's like uh, taped to the back that was on it. So uh, yeah, Clay Fighter Sculptor's Cut. That's absolutely amazing for $60 for this whole deal. This game alone is like, well, I don't know what it is now. It's like 250 bucks at least probably. But uh, yeah, I'm super pumped about it. I really took a lot of time to clean this game, and it looks really nice now. So, let's tell the rest of the story now. So, they were listening to games. He, said, he mentioned Clay Fighter and also, um, like, WrestleMania. I was, I was like, you know... Decided to ask which um, Clay Fighter and WrestleMania game it was. He said Clay Fighter Sculptor's Cut. And I was like, whoa. Whoa. I was like, dang. Like, is this guy, like, setting me up or something like that? I was thinking because to make this deal, you know, it's kind of a shady place to make a deal. But the, the guy was totally cool, you know. He, he looked really, really nice. Uh, he looked really happy, too. He was on. He was walking. And I don't know, I just thought it would have been kind of sketchy. But, you know, the guy is all cool and stuff. So, I thought it might have been a setup or something. Because, I mean, Clay Fighter Sculptor's Cut 
an N64 deal for $60, you know, I mean, that's absolutely amazing. I mean, the game is super rare. Rarest game on the console, I believe. And, I mean, this is just incredible. Now that I got the game, I am think I'm going to go for the complete N64 set since I got most of the other ones. I need, like, Bomberman Second Attack and I think Castlevania Legacy of Gar Darkness. So, uh, just those two rares, I'm all set for the rares. I mean, I got the um, Ogre Battle game, you know, I got, I got all the others. So, I mean, yeah, I think I'll go for the complete set. So, yeah, I mean, $60 for the whole deal. I can... I can get like 40 45 for the system, the two controllers, and then selling the new Tetris, I mean, that's a $12 game. So I get all my money back right there. So, I mean, absolutely amazing deal, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I mean, this is actually incredible. So I'll catch you guys later.